the world experiencing different problems. Problems like corruption, pollution, poverty, adequate education opportunities, and lack of quality health care. And aside from that, the COVID-19 pandemic. So, whose job is it to solve these problems? Business sectors, academic institutions, local government unit, non-government organizations. Well, academic institutions, business sectors, LGU, or NGOs are very crucial foundation to build strong, developed, and healthy society. But with the absence, one of these could not solve all the problems of the community. That's why we need civic engagement. So what is civic engagement? You know what? I've learned how um, individual participation in a community helps lessen or mitigate problems or local problems or concerns. It is called civic engagement. Authentic civic engagement is built on a shared understanding of community needs and a deep commitment to collaboration. Vibrant democracies create space for and encourage civic engagement. And when people make it their priority to engage, democracies is strengthened. I also learned that um, civic engagement takes many forms. It can be political or volunteering, joining local organizations, raising money to support your advocacy or your platforms, and as a communication student, using our voice to advocate. I've learned that civic engagement objectives is to achieve change and development, which requires bottom-up approach, wherein it is people-centered or community-centered. It is a concerned group of people or individual engage their organization to the public to address public concerns. And as a democratic country, our right to vote is one example. Everyone has the right to choose their leaders they know who have a good will in helping fellow Filipinos. And as a Filipino citizen, I will use this right to choose wisely. Hashtag no to vote buying. One concrete example of civic engagement is to become a youth leader to our respective communities. Being an SSG officer for six years was incredibly a big contribution because it served as a role model to our fellow students. In my community, we have this youth organization. This is called Batang Bagao Jovial Caring and Daring or BBJCD. It is a non-political organization that aims to restore the spirit of volunteerism and activeness of youth in achieving change and development. Youths come together, participating in activities like cleanup drives, gardening, community pantry, and many more. This shows that together, we can create a powerful force for the creation of thriving, development, just, and free, and healthy societies.